30 years ago today, my diary entry, Saturday the 9th of June, 1984. My brother got a car today. God, what a crate. Still, if he can get it on the road, I can have his bike in September. Hmm, I remember this car quite well. It was a Ford Escort Mark I. It was a wreck. It was rusted right through, pretty much everywhere. There was like big, whole, big holes in the floor. There was no way in hell it was ever going to pass an MOT. The engine worked. That was the thing. It did move. Um, the engine worked. The electrics worked. Um, but without some serious welding, it was never ever going to pass an MOT. And I remember what he did to it as well. He painted it um, and drew a... Actually, I drew the outline for him. An eagle on the bonnet, like, like a, a Pontiac Firebird kind of thing. And now I drew a pretty decent outline, but he painted it with gloss paint, the kind of thing you paint your door frames with and your skirting boards, gloss paint with a paintbrush that fat. What a twat! It looked ridiculous. And it sat on our drive for about a year. He spent loads of money, actually he, my dad gave him loads of money to customise it. He jacked up the rear, it's like leaf spring suspension, and he jacked it up with these metal plates that were about that long and had holes through them for the bolts. So, it looked fucking ridiculous. He spent hundreds, or my dad spent hundreds of pounds on it for him. And then scrapped it. You know, it sat there taking up space, soaking up money, and then he scrapped it because it wasn't going to pass the MOT. You know, it got friends round, Mig no, Tig welded it. Uh, no, it wasn't even that, brazed it. He, took, he cut out a big sheet of metal from the, a fridge door. Yeah, fridge door, cut it out, brazed it in place into the floor, and then like covered it in... Um, like pitch or tar kind of paint to cover over the fact that actually it wasn't it wasn't legit, it wasn't safe, it was a fucking disaster. Yeah, so uh, yeah, I can have his bike if he gets it on the road. Well, needless to say, I didn't get his bike when I turned 16. Um, he had a Honda SS50, which was quite good. It was like the Honda version of the FS1E, but the Honda was four-stroke. Uh, it wasn't as quick as a fizzy, but yeah, yes, so uh, that's that. It's just one of the many examples of how my brother was a twat and my father favoured him. <laughs> Bitter much? Mmm, fucking assholes. There you go, this day, 30 years ago. Thank you for watching. <laughs>